welcome back to my channel if you're new here hello my name is from and welcome to my channel it's a thursday and currently it's around 9 p.m i actually have a midterm for bpk tomorrow at 8 30 in the morning the thing is that i have not waken up that early for basically since summer so usually i wake up around nine so for me to wake up at like eight getting shower being prepared for the exam it's gonna be a little struggle for me so i definitely need to go to bed early i feel like i should go to sleep before midnight if that's even possible so i'm probably going to be facetime my dad actually and let him help me with like all this bpk stuff and i'm just not no bio is not my thing guys like in high school it's funny before like science 10 which you also have to take physics chem and bio i got the worst marks for bio even though it's supposed to be the easiest like i got like 60 percent on the bio but i got like 80 or 90 percent on chemistry and physics and i took chemistry 11 so some of the terminology like definitely like replies to this replies applies to this there are things that you like would learn in um bio 12 that i didn't learn so i'm a little bit lost i just want to start this a bit earlier because i don't want tomorrow to be just like me starting a video and stressing it out over starting this video while i'm already going to be a little bit stressed about this midterm i'm trying not to be as stressed about this midterm because i did make notes on it so i rewrote my notes which is not the best thing to do but my notes is just messy like and what i did for my new notes i use kind of like my map style so that it's easier to see everything connected and use flowchart more than just writing it down in the way that i did for my um, notebooks so i think i'm what i'm going to do is actually trying to facetime my parents right now they suggest me to do is kind of letting me explain to them what's happening and the process and then my dad would correct me and then if i have time i will try to go back to do like the discussion questions without looking at this i know it's kind of like the night before but yeah so probably not the best thing to do but at the same time we're already here so <laughs> well my parents decided not to pick up the phone but it's okay i guess i'll just do the review questions but now i'm gonna light my candle It is currently 12.30 and I finished my five chapters of discussion questions. Like for the black one are the things that I got it right and then if I didn't get it right, I'll cross it over and then I'll do it in red. I did that for all five chapters. See, I've changed. I have around 10 minutes, so I'm gonna make myself some matcha. I don't know, I don't feel as, I guess, scared because it's open book. At the same time, I know that if I don't know everything, it's gonna be really, really hard for me to find stuff. So, I kind of understand some stuff the last chapter ish oh wow you can see the fog a little bit on the other side of the river and vancouver too or it's just rain if you guys know a place where i can get a whisk for matcha please tell me i have nothing i think i'm a little bit weird well everybody's weird in their own way but i it's weird because i talk to myself to make youtube videos on my phone i'm not even talking to a real person i'm talking to a tech 
technology like device. Does that make sense? Alright, I have going to go and do my midterm now. I will check in with you guys afterwards. I finished my midterm. It was long. <laughs> I didn't get a chance to even finish the last question. I was like on the two last like sentences. So the last thing I wrote was an M. So and that question's worth six points. So I hope for the best from the group projects now. I don't know if I did right. I feel like I did okay. Like I think I passed for sure. But currently it is 9.30 and it's kind of cold. But at the same time, I want to work out because I want to. <laughs> I try to work out in the morning now because I finally found that my brain likes my like my body likes working out in the morning more definitely not going back to sleep that's a thing hello i know i know i haven't filmed anything today i just don't want to film too much because i don't want to just make it like a day in my life video because i'm not going to make that um so today it was just like a regular schedule where I studied so it's kind of really boring so I don't want to show you guys that so right now it's currently I think around 9 I am actually going to do some coding because I feel like I'm a little bit behind and all my code is currently not working plus I have an assignment due in two weeks so I want to get started on that and probably gonna call my friend while we code or I might FaceTime my parents before I leave for tomorrow. I think I never mentioned it yet. So I am going to go camping. It'll be the first time I'm going for like the fall season. So it's really cold. I am very scared because I actually went out to throw out the trash and it's actually really cold even outside, especially right now. It just rains, so it's colder than usual. I actually prepared three layers of pants, so I'm wearing two leggings and one sweatpants tomorrow. Right now, I have four. I will have um, turtleneck, a sweater, like a V-neck one, and then another. I think it's just like a hoodie, and then a jacket. I don't know if that's enough, low key. I might just have to wear like a T-shirt inside, or wear like an actual like sweater inside or something. I don't know. I'll bring an extra like sweater just in case. I feel like. But yeah, I have gloves, scarves, hat, all this stuff. It's gonna be like winter there, so. Oh, I also bring in two fuzzy socks, so I need to be prepared. Yeah, so I'm going camping, and I definitely am really tired from waking up early today. In the evening, when like I have no class, I was so tired. I'm like, should I take a nap? But at the same time, I'm like, I should be doing some work. So I just pushed through it and I haven't taken any naps and I'm so tired. Some a little update, I'm going to try my best to get you guys some montage of the trip. Yeah, that's why I want to do like separate section of my life because in the weekend this weekend, usually in the weekend I would, one day I would be hanging out with my friends. I try to balance social life more now, especially comparing to the summer semester where everything's getting better with like quarantine and everything, but obviously we still have to be cautious about what's happening with the corona situation. And I'm going to try my best to wake up at 6.30 or the latest is 7. So we'll see about that. I don't like waking up early. Also, since I have this platform, I want to use as a good um, thing to say something about what's happening in Thailand. So in Thailand right now, our, our system of democracy has been like, it's just really bad. It's just we're moving backwards into dictatorship and people right now are fighting to get our rights back. On October 16th, which was yesterday for Thailand time zone um, there was a big kind of protest in the city of Bangkok where police and people with power military basically used violence against the protesters while 
in the process that it doesn't really have anything on their hands. So that's not right. Using violence is definitely not the solution and everything. It's definitely heartbreaking for me to see what's happening. If you guys have some time, I'm going to put the link down below. Maybe some hashtags on Twitter, Instagram. I'm going to try and post some things on my Instagram social media as well. Just to help educate my foreign friends. It will be nice if you guys waste a little bit of your time to learn a little bit more about what's happening. So for tomorrow's plan, basically I would have to leave my place at 7.30. Basically meaning that I would have to wake up even earlier than I did today. That's why I'm going to sleep early because my brain will not be functioning properly. I will see you guys tomorrow. It is 7 o'clock. It's time to get ready. It's too bright. Mm. Mm. Did that work? I don't know if that works. But I've dressed up, I'm ready, and then I have 45 minutes before I have to leave my place. But what I'm wearing is this turtleneck course and I'm wearing this sweater and the bottoms I'm actually wearing high knee socks and two leggings I was gonna wear sweatpants too but it's kind of too hot so I'm not wearing it right now I'm just gonna say something oh in there I have a sweater like a regular like PJ sweatshirt and then one hoodie which I I think, I don't know, I mean it's better to pack more obviously but yeah I have that and then I'm going to wear another jacket on top of this so basically I have five layers for getting ready <laughs> for this because I don't know, like I don't know how cold it's gonna be, you know? and I have one blanket, one book, gloves, hat, scarf, uh, an emergency kit and then I'm obviously gonna wear a mask because I'm going to go on the sky train. This is low key a look. Like, I kind of like this. It's almost 7 30 and I need to leave to go to King George Sky Train Station to get picked up by my brother and my sister. So, I'm not gonna bring my book because it apparently is too thick. Well, look at it. Like, I'm, both, I'm halfway through the book and I really wanna finish it. getting some wood from this random house um, he got some free wood I think this was for camping in the summer and now they're not going so it's just in the backyard so we're just getting them free and then look at all the stuff we have it's quite a bit
hello guys i don't know if you guys can hear me but i'm currently in the tent right now i'm sleeping with my sister and my brother-in-law and i'm just wearing my sweatpants and my hoodie right now because it will get colder at night and right now basically we're just drinking chilling just catching up talking and it's actually a really chill like trip i'm just wearing this stranger things hoodie on top bloggers, bloggers. <laughs> yes we're famous yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody, to be more accurate, it's good afternoon because it's already like 12 20. <laughs> I'm going to help my sister clean up and pack everything that are like sleeping bags and blankets in the um, the bags, and we're gonna have a breakfast or lunch to be exact. But yeah, that's the update. My sock is wet because I actually it was so dark outside. When I, I need to pee, so I didn't. It, I decided just to like go without wearing my shoes because it's really hard to wear my docks. So I just went off with my <laughs> normal fuzzy socks, and it's like kind of still a bit wet. I mean, I changed my socks, have an extra pair of socks, so I changed that. And it's kind of my fault. I should have taken it off while went back to sleep but it's fine because it was like freaking three in the morning i don't want to freeze my feet so yeah i'm wearing four layer clothes right now Gatsby. Probably gonna do that. We're probably gonna stay here for another like half an hour or an hour and then we're gonna head back into the city. It's definitely really nice, you know, coming out of the city a little bit and being in nature, having a little peaceful time. It's definitely what I needed. I'm sorry I didn't take a lot of videos today because today is more like cleaning up, packing up and like I said, we woke up around 12 so yeah, but currently it's around 6pm got at home half an hour ago just took a shower and going to do some laundry doesn't clean my apartment probably just go and get some groceries to get veggies and fruits I'm going to end the vlog here I hope you guys enjoy this long it's kind of like a school slash weekend camping trip definitely needed that trip i think yeah it's an experience to do like a fall camping even though it's really cold but it's still really nice to you know hang out with people have no internet connection kind of just mostly when i'm on my phone it was just me vlogging for you guys i hope you guys enjoy it i will see you guys in the next upcoming video Bye. I like me better when I'm with you.